What's going on, guys? It's your boy Adjen Bagen for another Outer Plane video. And for today, it's time for some play testing of a new set called Augmentation Set. So, this one is a new set that came through this recent patch. And uh, I'm gonna be testing it out in PvP Arena. So, what does Augmentation Set do? Uh, if you take a look at the set uh, bonuses here, uh, this is a two piece set. Uh, it, it increases damage while buff. How much increased damage, we don't know. I don't know also because uh, it's pretty big. They did not indicate how much damage increase we will be getting by equipping this set. But I'm still gonna be testing it out whether this set is good or not. Uh, so far, my rolls for these gears are kinda crap. Uh, as you can see, I have uh, effectiveness 10% here. Evasion, speed is okay, plus 12. Uh, crit damage, did, it did not fall on crit damage. Uh, this one, it has some rolls on crit damage and some speed, which is all, already pretty nice. Uh, this one has some rolls in crit chance and uh, I believe one speed. And then this one is also crit chance and speed and some uh, plot attack. Uh, you can get this uh, pre-augmentation set from doing the hard mode of the Season 2 story mode. Uh, these are pre and one of the good things about this one are they are most likely almost equal to legendary gears why it's because when you get them as a blue gear they already have four stats which is pretty okay because usually uh blue gears only has three stats right and you need to report to get the port stat but when you when you get this uh set for pre by a one-time clear reward uh they are already Four stats, so you already have a bonus uh, reports uh, for them, uh, but still RNG uh, to roll on a damaging set. I believe this one is a really good uh, damaging set, but we will see in PvP arena. Uh, this might probably be an alternative to critical damage set. Uh, so far, this one I'm, I'm gonna be testing it out on Notia. So this is my stats for Notia: uh, 3.8k attack. Uh, 223 speed, critical chance 50%, critical damage 214%, pretty much on the low side because uh, these are pre gears and if you will see the sub stats, they are subpar. Yes, uh, but you can still reroll re the sub stats with the transit stone uh, if you really want. But I'm just gonna be testing this one now. If this one is a really good uh, pre gears for newbies. Uh, I'm using the weapon uh, attack percent here main. 15% uh, crit chance, 20 crit damage, plus 12 speed. And then my necklace is an attack necklace. Uh, because this one gives a really, really low attack. Uh, if, I, if I remove the attack necklace, my attack will not be around uh, 3.8. It will be uh, at the very low side. Uh, maybe you can uh, either use a penetration necklace or... A speed set because Notia is a really high speed character but uh, since this set gives you bonus damage while buff uh, still okay to use on Notia because uh, she will follow up with the if your teammates uh, inflict a debuff to the enemy right and she already has a uh, buff at the start of the battle with her exclusive equipment uh, if you don't know what her exclusive equipment is, uh, Grand Spears Offensive per one third at the start of battle. So she already has a uh, preemptive buff. So the effects of the augmented augmentation set should be already applicable when the battle starts. And that is uh, my main uh, theory crafting for this one. Also, this one, I believe speed set is way, way better compared to this one. But speed, speed set is speed set. This one is augmentation set, so let's test it out in PvP arena whether this one is good or not to showcase uh, the damage potential of this one. Uh, I'm not really sure how to fight uh, these teams here uh, because as you can see, the teams are pretty much uh, the meta teams. Uh, it's really hard to fight meta teams with uh, something like an experimental with this one. Let us try to fight this one. One of my guildmates, uh, Cha Cha Boom. Uh, I'm gonna be using uh, since the enemy has Mene. So I'm I'm guessing that 
uh, Valentine is going to be passed. Also, if you have a 6 star distillate, uh, shield is already considered a buff. So, that one will work pretty well also for uh, augmentation set. Uh, let's just try to do this one. Because I can activate Notia's attack already with my Valentine here. Let us see. Uh, the speed is... Uh... Oh. Uh, his DST is very slow. Let us see. How much damage uh, Notia will do here. So since my Notia has a... As a 50% critical chance with Valentine's buff, it becomes a critical 100% uh, crit, crit chance. So, Notia's attack should be critting them. Now, let us do some debuffs here. Okay, how much damage Notia? 34k damage, not bad. She one shots uh, the Aste. Okay, Pog. It's not bad. It's not bad. And uh, the only condition for the augmentation set to have the increased damage damage is that uh, you should have a buff, right? Uh, I can probably kill this one. Phew! It miss. Still, do the job. Uh, you might be uh, expecting a uh, 100k damage from uh, the augmentation set, right? But I don't think uh, that is the case with this one. Maybe you can still uh, equip that one on the Aste. Uh, the problem with the Aste is that if you equip that one on the Aste, your the Aste will be very, very slow. Uh, but let us try. Let us try to equip that one. The Aste. How should I uh, do that one? Maybe try to challenge this one. Uh, let's try to equip this one. I'm gonna be unequipping the... Because I was using uh, attack uh, attack gears that in that one. Uh, there you go. I think this one is uh, good enough. So against this one, I'm gonna be using this one. Since I need some protection and uh, she will be buff even though if, if she die. Because she will have the buff from her uh, passive uh, skill too. Let us test out the augmentation set on the Aste to see whether how much damage uh, we can deal to the enemy. Oh, my Leo is very fast. The enemy is very slow. What? So I have the invulnerability buff here pro pro uh, from Leo. And the resilience buff. So I am buff. Let us see how much damage my DSD will do to the enemy. Uh, let us see. I hope it crits. And do not miss. You very, very weak. <laughs> it's very weak. It's very weak. That is not an attack buff. Maybe because it's not an attack buff, that is why it's very weak. Uh, I'm not sure how to uh, how to properly use that augmentation set. How can we fully utilize that one? How can we fully utilize that one?
This Nova creating my uh, this Tela. Like what? So this one she has a buff also. Damage increase. Uh, what is that damage increase buff? Let us see. Come on, crit. Do some crit. You, it's very, very weak. Yes, it's very weak. Maybe if we have some, uh, we have some buff from uh, Valentine and uh, Cindy. Maybe that one will not hit that weak. And also, my weapon is kind of meh. Let me change the weapon because uh, I, that one is a preset to my uh, Notia. Uh, I have better weapons to use. I have this uh, thumping duster here. And then I'm gonna be using the penetration necklace. This one. 3.5k at the... Oh, the crit chance is very low. 29%. <laughs> what? Maybe let's try to uh, change this one with critical chance. So now it's 65%. 3.7k attack. Uh, let's try something that does not have uh, this one. Something that we can fully utilize on... Uh, since you don't have any other tax set here. Let's just use this one for now. Oh, it does not matter. Okay, let's try the Aste augmentation set against uh, this tanky team with Cindy and Valentine Bob. Uh, Veronica will uh, start uh, before uh, the Aste. I just hope that I can survive uh, Veronica's uh, burst. We will see. We will see. Oh wait, I can just uh, push the Aste now. Let us push the Aste. Okay. So this one has uh, attack accuracy buff from Cindy and also critical chance, critical damage buff from Valentine. Uh, this is wearing augmentation set the Aste. Let us see how much damage it will deal to the enemy. Come on, give me some uh, rig, big PP damage. Yeah, 57k. It's not, it's not good. It's not good, it's pretty weak. My speed set is way way better with penetration necklace. Yeah, that is uh, what I've been using with my uh, the Aste. Augmentation set is a disappointment. No wonder they did not put how many uh, damage increase we will be getting by equipping the set. It's really, really disappointing and uh, I don't know why this set exists. Maybe it's troll. Uh, let us see. Can you one shot? Phew, and it did not crit. It did not crit. Then I'm dead. <gasps> what the fuck? It's pretty weak, man. It's pretty weak. Compared to my uh, speed set, I will show you my uh, Diaste speed set. How much damage my Diaste speed set is compared to that one? Uh, let's try to, to fight this one. Uh, 
Mm, di Aste. Attraction. Okay. Let us compare the damage to my uh, normal di Aste build. Compared to the augmentation set. Uh, with Cindy and Valentine back, it's only around 55k, right? How about now? How about now? Let us see. This one, same scenario, but different kind of set. How much damage? You 80k! Look at the difference, guys. 30k difference. So, yeah. Augmentation set, not good. In conclusion, it's not good. As per my uh, playtesting here, it's not really that good. Uh, push. Push back. What? Revive? <laughs> oh man. Don't die. Uh, can I one shot? Without accuracy buff? Pew! No! I'm dead. Well, there you go, guys. That is my playtesting with the augmentation set. And in my conclusion, by playtesting with the augmentation set, I don't think it's a really good set. Maybe the stats are kind of lacking. Maybe if we can have some really decent substats, a really godly substats on augmentation set, maybe it will be a really good set. I just wish that uh, the developers put some... Uh, they show us uh, how much damage we can gain by equipping that set. I don't know why uh, the description is pretty big. Uh, it's really a mess. Well, I think that's it for me for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you can help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.